everybody in the world doesn't know about these diseases in our body, but a research study claims that there are certain foods you can eat on a regular basis to assist your body fight against them. In this video, I'll tell you about a few of the items you should include in your diet on a daily basis to protect yourself against potentially harmful diseases. 1. Folate, minerals, vitamins, magnesium, phytochemicals, and a whole lot of other nutrients can assist to keep your body healthy all the time, so it's important to include a variety of dark leafy vegetables in your daily diet if you want to be strong and fight off sickness. In addition, it aids your body in its struggle against diabetes. 2. Sweet potatoes, which are loaded with antioxidants and phytochemicals like folate, calcium, potassium, iron, fiber, and a whole lot more, are another food to include in your disease-fighting diet. 3. Berries are another locally accessible food that can aid in illness prevention. They contain high levels of anthocyanin and other antioxidants, which may reduce your risk of developing cancer and other debilitating diseases. Eating more berries like cranberries, strawberries, blueberries, and many more in your regular diet will help you reach your goal. 4. Fatty fish, which are rich in omega-3 fatty acid, are another viable nutritional option. This can help reduce the risk of life-threatening blood clots and other heart-related disorders. 5. Beans, which include enough folic acid, fiber, magnesium, and many other nutrients that work together to prevent cancer and manage blood pressure, are another item you should aim to eat every day. 6. Vitamin C in citrus fruits, like oranges, grapefruits, lemons, and limes, is not just a powerful antioxidant, but supports both the innate, you were born with it, and adaptive, your body developed it, immune systems in multiple ways, such as promoting wound healing, creating stronger skin, artery, and intestinal lining barriers against pathogens, reducing oxidative stress that could worsen infections, killing microbes directly, and cleaning up the byproducts of the infection-fighting process. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Thanks for watching and bye for now.